Phone fans, we're on day 29, we've already done a few videos today, but I'm just going to film another progression in how to get a dog to walk nicely on the lead. So we've, we've worked through stages of encouraging the dog to be around us all the time, for encouraging the dog to want to be around us all the time. She's then gone on the lead and just walked around us, wherever she's gone, and we've then introduced having the lead tight, and if the dog has the lead tight, we're going to walk the opposite way. That's going to create a bit of anxiety in the dog. What we're going to do today is I'm going to try and get the lead tight and I'm going to keep applying pressure until the dog learns that I have to go that way to release this pressure. We want the dog to learn that itself. And when she does that, I'm going to give her loads of praise and then because she's got short memory, she's going to forget that and go off and sniff something else and um, I'm going to repeat it a few times. And we want the dog to learn if this leads tight, this is how I uh, sort it out myself. Now, before we film this, I've just come out and I've removed as many distractions from the garden as possible. So all the, the petals and leaves on the ground, I've removed them because we don't want any distractions until we want to add them. We don't want to be caught off guard. So start thinking forward, thinking ahead, and think of what distractions there are and how many you can remove. So we'll see how we go. Obviously, to get a dog to walk on a lead, she has to be on the lead. There's a good gear. There's a good gear. There's a good gear. So, we want tension on the lead. When we pull on it, we don't want to pull up. We don't want to pull up like this. We want to pull the opposite way, like this. Good gear, good gear. So when she leaves that tension, that's what we want. Busy, 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 busy. Good girl, good girl. So there's tension. Good girl. Tension. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Tension. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. So it's as simple as that. You're applying tension and you're waiting until the dog relieves it herself and then you're praising that. Um, She's not only as jumpy and skitty as around as that, but she's not been outside very many times now. She only had a jab the other day. So uh, we're going to keep that going. We'll just do a little and often. Every time we take her out for a wee, we put a little bit of that in before I pick her up and bring her home. And over time, she's going to learn. If that leads tight, I do this, and it makes it all better. And then eventually, she'll just learn, you know what, save the trouble of that. I just won't let the lead go tight. I'll just stay right next to my dad's leg, and everything will be okay. So we'll keep doing that. We'll keep updating you. Practice yourselves.